Okay, clearly said the importance that good infrastructure plays for officers to do their duty. I am glad after a wait that Tripura has got the GST Bhavan and we see that the place has enough room for officers and others from the field formations to work and more importantly that it has a place where citizens who are part of the stakeholders who have some interest in the GST or who would want to become assassins can approach this office and there is a space dedicated for their purpose with an officer seated there to answer their questions. In case they want to do filing from here itself, either because they don't have the facility, they are operating at a very small level, even that facilitation is being provided. So, I, I think this, this construction speaks for the open-mindedness with which GST and its officers are trying to keep the citizen in mind, the businesses in mind, the traders in mind and creating an office set up wherein they can function but they can be accessible for those who need that help. These are consumption based tax and the more a state consumes, the more GST is collected from there and therefore to that extent, commensurate extent, GST is also provided to that state. Tripura, just one minute, I think I've got a different page. Tripura, actually before the GST was introduced, received only 4.21 crores as central sales tax collection and from the collection, Tripura share was 4.21 crores. And that is true of 2016-7, the year 17, the year before GST was introduced. Whereas in 22-23, the year which ended as of March 23, Tripura collects 982.50 crores from interstate trade. Where is 4.21 crore and where is 9. Point, uh, uh, sorry, 982, 4.21 versus 982.5 crore to 50 crores, 982.50 crores within a matter of 5 to 6 years. So post GST, the collection and the revenue generation for Tripura has been extremely favorable. Where it was single digit, it's gone to three digits in crores. So interstate trade has now been greatly facilitated and therefore I think uh, it is uh, showing on how GST has actually meant good for the Northeast teams and Tripura's number is almost enviable. Of course, Tripura needs a lot more resources. But the fact that within six years, under the same head, you are getting so much more proves the need for a greater coordination through the GST. And of course, with GST coming in, 
more businesses have come into the system. However, with an office like this, with a bhavan like this, and which has kept the citizen in mind, I would think it's necessary for us, for us all, to do an outreach along with the state government so that more small businesses understand that they stand to benefit by enrolling in the GST. By staying away, many of the benefits which accrue to the GST registered companies are not available if they stay out. Even if they are just composition, uh, those who opted for the composition system, they still derive a lot of benefits. Large companies do not want to buy or procure goods or service from non-GST institutions. It will do well for more and more institutions to come into the GST fold for which now, now that you have a building in your hand, it will be important to call the trade small associations or big associations and interact with them to say through their members get more people enrolled and for which the state government also should be requested to cooperate and draw more people from uh, Tripura. And when I speak of Tripura, I am fully conscious that the terrain is such that access to some parts of the state is very difficult. And for such areas, it might help for us to go there and sit and talk rather than invite them, leaving their businesses to come over to the power. So there should be a two-pronged approach. Those who can come here through the associations, let them come. And for those who are in the far flung areas, in order that they can appreciate the GST's benefits, it might be worth the officers here to consider going and meeting them in their respective areas and telling them what it does to their own businesses and to the state as well. So without taking much of your time, this building will give you all the necessary infrastructural requirement which normally officers should basically have. It's not